If you can see me or not, what's going on YouTube? This is Josh Williams with Bear Productions. Um, in the new studio space for uh, most of our work, um, Ariel and I are getting married next weekend. Super excited. Um, actually living in the apartment first before we get married and then move in together married um so yeah this is the studio space um but wanted to give you guys an update of what was going on um we recently just got accepted to pond five which is a stock music site that we're going to try to start making residual income from um, we uploaded a lot of our hip-hop tracks. We'll probably share some of those down in the description below. We have an opportunity to um, get on another music site called Music Bed. Um, very, very high-grade quality stuff. A lot of filmmakers use uh, Music Bed for a lot of their videos. And um, we got a chance to get in contact with Josh Crispin, who is a uh, one of their affiliates, composers, and um, Hopefully in the next couple days before the submissions are closed, we'll be able to get to talk to him and uh, find out what exactly Musicbed is kind of looking for. And that's something that I think we'll do in a greater, we'll scale it um, later down the line with YouTube uh, is maybe having like interviews with these guys. Cause Josh Crispin, we talked to uh, Jeffrey Manchester uh, last week actually. Um, about um, how composers can try to try to get work because um, sometimes it can be rather scarce when you're starting out uh, especially when you don't have any footage or clientele to kind of pull from so um, we did that we also talked to a guy named Alex Mokala and um, he actually um, is one of the guys that kind of inspired me to go ahead and dive into um, trailer music, which is some of the last things we've been posting on our YouTube channel. And he actually gave us a nice 15 minute review of one of our tracks that we sent them. So this next one that we're going to come out with, we're going to send it through him first and see what else we can, uh, where else we can improve to make our things better so that we can shoot out to more of these trailer companies. We did that a lot last week as well. We shot out emails to some of our favorite trailer companies like Epic Music, uh, Position Music, End of Silence. All these guys are really, really great with um, making placements. And, and a couple of them actually did respond with um, reviews of what we could do to get better. So um, as of this point right now, we have not been able to land with a um, trailer company yet but we're getting very close. A lot of the reviews that they're giving us is not on our ideas or mixing, but um, the style. So this is very, very good. It means that in the last couple weeks or months that we've been starting to do trailer music, we have the right idea with mixing and um, ideas are solid. So all we need to do is make sure that they're in line with the style of how trailer music is written today, which can change at any moment as well. Um, let me think, what else? We hit 5,000 on Instagram. Um, super cool benchmark for us. Um, all organic followers um, and mostly filmmakers, which is super awesome. We should be making a new list of people to hit up with different projects and side reels very, very soon. We'll be able to share that with our channel as well. I had a new idea. I don't know if you guys would be interested in this, but uh, leave it in the comments. I have an Ableton push pad that I'm starting to substitute as a piano for my mobile setup. It'd be really cool to start showcasing, I don't know, um, chord melody ideas uh, just to show the um, growth and how I'm learning how to play piano on something that's not a piano. It's kind of like the push is a piano and a guitar meld into one. So um, interesting. Uh, let me know if you guys are interested in actually seeing something like that. It's really cool. It's got a lot of colors. Uh, colors. And we had some different, um, another couple different ideas like possibly um, maybe listing out our goals for the next year coming up. Also, um, maybe making some terminology words that we can give to filmmakers so that you guys know how to talk to composers. Um, I needed to 
feel this way and the composer has to kind of translate what that means in the music. So let me know if that's something interesting to you guys that you would possibly want to mess with. Um, yeah, so that's going to be the end of this video. Hopefully you guys can actually see me on the screen here. We got to get better lighting in here. But until then, this is Josh Williams with Bear Productions. I'll catch you guys next time. Hey guys, this is Ariel and Josh, and you're listening to an original composition by Bear Productions. That's us too. Make sure you like and subscribe for more epic content. Awesome.